to see that play um, from where I was, the angle. I haven't looked at the video. Um, you know, uh, Vic thought he got fouled on that play, thought a couple of things happened, but I haven't looked at the video and really couldn't tell from, from my angle. Did, did you ask for a review or should there have been a review? Uh, no, I didn't ask for a review. Uh, hi, Nate. Ken Miller with the call and post. On the very last possession when LeBron got the ball, did you try to do anything to prevent him from getting the ball? Or is he just that good to where he got the ball? No, we, we had uh, – Bogey was basically uh, d helping to deny um, a LeBron on that. He ended up going towards half court. And, uh, you know, then he went back to his man. And he made a hell of a play. But, you know, I, I'll take – take that on uh you know far as uh, execution on that last play you know we have a timeout uh to talk about uh you know what we see out there and we have a file to give you know we leave here with both of them and um you know thaddeus had five fouls and uh, was covering lebron uh a little hesitant there but uh you know we, we had two things that we could have used in that situation that we didn't and um you know, we go home with this foul to give and a timeout. On the quickly on the previous play before that, when Oladipo actually, whether it was a goal ten or not, I thought you had a an advantage uh, with Sabonis being guarded by J.R. Smith. Did you at all want to try to get him the basketball in that situation, considering the game he was having? No, we had an advantage, probably uh, without setting that screen. You know, LeBron has been pretty much uh, directing their defense. Uh, you know, we basically had a uh, high ball screen with our five man. He bumped off Nance and came up with the screen uh, and was the guy, the, five, the big that switched out. In that situation there, you, you call off the screen and you just attack uh, Smith. Uh, and we went through with the screen. Uh, we did have a uh, s small on on um, Domas, but in that situation, Victor uh, out there spread. We're going to take we're going to take our chances with that with that matchup. <clears throat> Nate, we always hear about the Jordan rules. Are there any rules available for guarding LeBron? And is there something else you can do? Well, you know, you can uh, you can run run double teams uh, at him at, to try to get the ball out of his hands. You know, he's an excellent passer. He's a willing passer. Uh, you know, with the shooters on the floor, uh, you know, he, he basically picks you apart uh, when you play that type of defense. You know, th I think the thing you you try to do is just keep him in front and make him make shots. He's very capable of doing that, uh, but. You know, uh, there are certain places on the floor uh, when when he has the ball, we do send a double team. Um, but, I mean, made a hell of a shot again tonight. 